I'm doing a vlog, like, a little quick. Let's talk about, hey, I'm Tay. Welcome. Listen, I just, I didn't wake up. Just wake up. I've been up since 6 o'clock in the morning. But this is a vlog um, of the Blue Lips Schoolboy Q concert tour. Okay, I'm going to the Fillmore in Silver Springs. Um, yeah, I just got finished drying my nails. My toes are done. Uh, I set out all my makeup. Um, what else I got going on? What else? What else? What else? That's it. So, follow me. Hope you guys enjoy. Um, yeah. And I'll just be throwing in clips here and there. Just documenting the whole experience. Because he is my favorite male rapper, Schoolboy Q. Make sure y'all check out Blue Lips. Oxymoron. Uh, a blank, t blank face. Crash talk. All of that. All of that. But before I do anything else, I gotta make the kid some breakfast. She's gonna eat um, some grapes, a fruit salad. Okay, she loves a good fruit salad, some yogurt, um, and some cereal. Yes, come on. So, yeah, let's take care of this. And then I'm going to try to do a little bit of relaxing. Um, it's ready to be play schoolboy Q music all motherfucking day, bitch. So, oh, I'm gonna have to clip out the cursing, huh? Whatever. Um, I am gonna fast. Um, I'm, no, I'm gonna eat some fruit. Like, it's just a fruit day. Like, on concert days, I don't eat heavy. I just like to eat, you know, my fruit. And if I want something from the venue, I'll get some french fries or something. But, you know yeah so a fruit salad for me as well <laughs> i have some green grapes some watermelon and some grapefruit grapefruit is an acquired taste for sure i like it i didn't when i was a kid but now i do but mm -hmm. Put you in a movie. Uh, niggas can smoke like a Lucy. Fox 5, Channel 9, make the newsy. Ain't my bad that she chose to be choosy. Look, I got bitches. I got hops. Okay, y'all. So, this is the outfit. These pants. Um, Actually, my sister had a pair of these pants. And I was like, girl, where you get these pants from? And she bought me a pair. So, shout out to my sister. Um, My top. I got this top about three years ago. Um... I was like, I'm not wearing it yet until Q come back outside. So, yeah, this will be my first time wearing this top, okay? Now, I did have this bag right here. I never wore it. Just got it, honey. Ravenclaw, okay, period. But I decided on, since the venue has a bag policy, I think this may be a little bit too big. So, I'm just going to wear my little uh, fanny pack or whatever. And then I got, of course, my chunk. Yeah, 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 see? <laughs> but yes, this is the fit. I'm gonna throw in some accessories and all of that. Mm -hmm. I couldn't take a nap, so sucks for me. This is why I have my long back. Yeah, um, so I'm just in here. Um, I'm ready to do a um, sugar and honey uh, tea tree oil oregano oil scrub for my face and then i'm gonna put it on my face let it sit um i'm gonna do a herbal bath sit in the bath honey and um after i get out and from the bathroom and doing all that i will start the makeup process so i want to show you guys what i'm using today i am using glam lights scooby-doo palette this is not sponsored i love glam light um fred fred got the blues on deck come on nigga what's good <laughs> and I'm using for the first time um uh Glam Lights uh Friday the 13th palette. Jason, it got a blue in here too. So yeah. <laughs> but yes, the process will commence shortly. Um, I think I'm going to, and then when I do my eyes, I'm gonna take a break and eat a salad. Um, the highlighter I'm using Glam Light. I love Glam Light, like people that know me personally already know that like, <laughs> girls. I got a bunch of glam like, well, it's over here. <laughs> Not sponsored, but I do love their products, okay? But yeah, let me show y'all the Friday the 13th. I don't know how to open this thing. Okay, here we go. Ugh. Look at the, yeah. 
the blue. Yes, per. Okay, so the herbal bath, you know, I'm not gonna give all of the secrets away, but I'll give a little tea, a little something, something, something. So I have some um, rose petals in here. Mm. Some chamomile that I grew, um, the rose petals I grew. We have to actually go downstairs and get some more because I dried some out, so I need to get them for my bath. Um, I do uh, cinnamon sticks. Uh, what else I put in my bath? I, I sprinkle a little witch hazel in there, a little um, Epsom salt. But um, yeah, I put some other things in there as well. Little flowers, you know, from my garden, homegrown honey. But uh, make it however you like, whatever herbs you like. Okay, y'all, this is the garden a couple of days after the concert. I was in a rush to get to Silver Springs, honey. I did not want to be in traffic. By the way, traffic was great. Um, but, yeah, I didn't want to be in traffic, so I had to rush out, and I forgot to show y'all. So, here we are. Okay, so we have some tomatoes. I got some pumpkins that done grew up the tomatoes. It's trellising. Got some corn. Got some pole beans, some cucumbers. I got a loofah back there. Uh, pepper plant sage eggplants i got some basil some cucumbers uh more pumpkins lemon balm oregano um tomato plant like yeah i got some cherry tomatoes like yeah but this is just the basic you know my garden over here i got a greenhouse i got some more pots i got some more stuff but yeah let's get back into blue lips like i got my blue moo moo on <laughs> Listen, it's blue lips, but we're also doing blue eyes, okay? I really love how the makeup blended well and turned out. I'm a natural eyebrow girl. Like, I love my natural eyebrows, the thickness, the shape. So, I just clean them up. Now, back in the day, honey, I used to arch them and all that. Nah, I'm not doing that right now in this stage of life, okay? Listen, you're going to get what you're going to get. I love bright uh, colors on the eyes because I do wear glasses. So, I want the color to pop. I'm not a contact girl. I love my glasses. Now look, here we go. The final, yes, period. Mm-hmm. This is the final look. I love how it turned out. I added my blue bucket hat that I had for years. Honey, I was into bucket hats before I became a fan of Q. But once he was, you know, wearing a bucket hat in that phase, honey, it just made me uh, make my collection even more bigger. But I love how it turns out. I look good, honey. Giving what needs to be gave. Okay, period. Now it's time to hit the road. But it's gonna take me an hour to get there and it's not bad. I'll probably get there uh, by 5 30, so that's good. Um, yeah, because I got the VIP um, Blue Lips Lounge. Okay, we're gonna be chilling. VIP teams. Okay, period. Only. Okay, um, but yeah, I'm gonna let my head down when I get to the venue. Um, because the humidity, I don't want my head to um, cur like curl kink up. Um, so I wanted to hold these little crinkles as much as it, it can. So, yeah, y'all already know how I do, honey. This stuff will be plaited up until I get to the venue and then I'm going to let it down. Um, but, yeah, maybe. I mean, I like the plaid, but I'll let it down. But I'm going to check in in a few. Come on, y'all got to come on. Sir, people, use your freaking blinker. It's blue lip season. The fuck? Um, I got me some fruit. Gonna eat me some pineapples, honey, at the next red light. And, um, yeah, like, <laughs> this is what's going on. Period. <laughs> I'll check back. Continue on. Honey, we are in the Silver Spring uh, Street. Oh, man, I left my scrunchie. Oh, well, my head gonna have to be out there. So, take it out. But we in the Silver Spring streets. I always love Silver Spring. It's nice. You know, you got the Discovery headquarters in Silver Spring. You know, you know. Um, but yeah, I've been out here a few times for concerts and eaten at, uh, you know, the different restaurants out here. It's really nice. I like coming out here. So let me finish. Not that TJ Maxx in here. They really want a girl to come shopping, honey. 
while, while we wait for the VIP to add stuff to start. Okay. But the line was right around the corner, honey. As it should be per. But I come out to the show, have a good time. Okay. All right, I'm ready to go to the car and finish smoking. And um, might give y'all a little parking lot dance session. Maybe, we'll see. So beautiful. It's street art. Let's get the chucks in. It's beautiful. It's been five years since the last tour, so I was just so happy to see him. Gave him a good hug, honey, and I started dancing, child. <laughs> I wanted to make him smile, period. It's been so long. We be all going through stuff. I just want to see my nigga and put a smile on his face, period. And that's exactly what I did. <laughs>
Fuck yeah, ass, pity in the mouth ass Bitch ass, trick ass Fuck yeah, ass, dick in the mouth ass Fuck yeah, ass, dick in the butt ass Bitch ass, nigga, you suck
right, DC, we about this motherfucker, man. Y'all may say y'all drive safe, do not drink and drive, and you can smoke and fly. So I'm going to take my sign schoolboy Q thing. It might be dead. I don't know. It's still moving. But here you go. If you want to die, die over there. Anyways, follow Let's Talk Wild for all animal <laughs> news and all of that stuff. But um, I just want to say I had so much fun at the concert. Um... It's been five years, but Q is back better than ever, and he looks great. And I just had a good old time, man. Just y'all don't understand. Like I'm just so happy that he's in such a great space, um, and I feel like your fans grow with you. So you know, sometimes we be going through stuff too, and we be needing you know support and stuff like that. So sometimes. They be going through artists, they be going through things at the same time their fans be going through things. So, you know, it just it's just great. It's just great that he's in a much better uh, space. And yeah, he back outside, bitch. Q season, blue season. Y'all already know what the fuck going on. I'll hit y'all up later. This was a great day. I gotta post all my videos and pictures. Everything has been saved in the fucking draft. Do you hear me? Bye. Bye. I'm back in Baltimore, y'all. Uh-uh, not you pulling up, sir, with all of that. <laughs> um, but I'm back in Baltimore, y'all. Um, that little hour drive wasn't nothing. Um, yeah closing remarks i enjoyed the concert i'm so glad q is back outside um you know q season blue season blue season q season y'all already know what the fuck is going the fuck on okay period um but i had fun um made you know a few new acquaintances um you know when i go to these concerts by myself i always you know, just meet people and then we be instagram um, social media friends for, for years and years and years and it be all love but uh, shout out to everybody I hope everybody else made it home safely uh, y'all can check out Let's Talk Wild for all animal stuff um, but thank you for checking out my first concert vlog love yourself one another your pets and animals here are some cute outtakes and stuff that you know I forgot to put in the video so here it is now so I was playing Pokemon Go I'm here with my Nidoking. King he is called Crip King okay and I set a lure module um, for ice type Pokemon um, at the Fillmore it is a Pokemon stop um, I had already you know caught the Pokemon out there so ain't none popping up right now the lore module is not doing what it needs to do but look at the drip we looking real you know you know blue season period so I hope whoever else was playing um, you know was able to catch some Pokemon and catch a shiny yeah it's always nice seeing Mingo. Our picture came out very blurry, but nonetheless, it's still love. So happy to see him and see that he's in good health. You already know. Look at their beautiful posters. The 
Fillmore is so legendary. Yeah, right.